Well, recreational marijuana in Massachusetts is now legal. What does that mean? Well, it certainly doesn't mean that you can just light up and walk down the street. WBZ's Beth Germano is live at the State House tonight with all the details you need to know about this new law, and there seems to be a lot of confusion. Beth? And there is, David, because you can possess it, you can use it, you can even home grow it, but you still can't legally buy marijuana in Massachusetts just yet without a doctor's prescription. But for some, this new law is new freedom of speech. Uh, this is some high-end glass specific artists. Looking at these pipes in Brian's such as Alston store, there's a new vocabulary that can be spoken out loud. Customers can say bong and they can discuss what they're actually putting in the pipe. Until today, smoking marijuana was illegal in the state, and Such took the restricted language seriously to keep his smoke shop buried treasures in business for so long. It just wasn't discussed. It wasn't discussed, and if it was brought up, you were asked to leave. But now Massachusetts residents can possess 10 ounces of marijuana at home, one ounce in public, and grow six plants per adult at home up to 12. It's still illegal to sell marijuana and smoke it in public. People are really excited that they're, uh, they're able to grow their own. At the Grow Your Own store in Cambridge today, business was booming, and free seeds were being handed out, mindful of the fact pot shops won't open for legal sale for another year. There still is a little bit of a stigma associated with it, but that's fading. Uh, people are, are um, they're, they're kind of coming out of the closet, if you will, you know, from, the, from the, glow, the grow closet. Still, there's concern about legal gray areas for law enforcement, and today Governor Baker said he'd support a reasonable delay in the legal sale of marijuana if the legislature sought it. On the public safety piece and the public health thing, uh, I think there are legitimate concerns and issues that have been raised by many people. Um, the details obviously matter on that. For now, Brian Such doesn't see a new budding marijuana business just yet. I think that everybody who smokes already smokes. There's not a big population that's going to go out there and try. There's going to be a small amount of people who will try it. So retail stores are not set to open until January 2018, but that is the date some legislators are looking to possibly change so more details in this law can be worked out. Reporting live from the State House, I'm Beth Germano, WBZ News.